Hello, my name is Greg Ju with Keysi Technologies here at Mobile World Congress. Today we're showing our flexible test bed for 5G waveform generation analysis, which consists of our 5G software solutions combined with our test equipment. This test bed provides flexibility in generating different types of waveforms being proposed for 5G applications with different bandwidths at different frequencies from RF to microwave to millimeter wave. So to demonstrate the flexibility of this test bed today, I've got our system view design software with the 5G baseband exploration library installed on the embedded controller. We've, we're going to do a simulation and what it's going to do is it's going to download IQ waveforms to our precision wideband AWG arbitrary waveform generator and then we're going to go into our PSG signal generator routing the wideband IQ inputs uh, to a 20 gigahertz or modulating onto a 2 gigahertz or 20 gigahertz carrier frequency. This is going to go into our scope and this is a high performance scope that does measurements up to 62 gigahertz and so this combination provides flexibility in generating signals up to 44 gigahertz, analyzing up to 62 gigahertz, and if we want to do millimeter wave frequencies, we could run it into a millimeter wave up converter to up convert to millimeter wave. So let me get to the actual demo. So here we're simulating a, a 5G candidate waveform. It's an FBMC filter bank multi-carrier. We're combining it with an LT signal, combining the waveforms together, resampling it, and I've downloaded the waveform. And this is what it looks like. So we have our FBMC signal. We've carved out a notch in the center and we've parked an LTE signal in the center of this notch. We can demodulate this, play with the notch width, and, and evaluate what if scenarios to see where that 5G signal starts to impact the 4G signal. Now, wideband is also of interest, particularly for microwave frequencies and millimeter wave frequencies. And so to demonstrate uh, that, I'm going to use our Signal Studio for custom modulation, which has a 5G capability. And specifically, we're going to generate an FBMC signal spanning over 2 gigahertz of bandwidth. So I'm going to go ahead and start the um, generation, waveform generation. And I'm going to download it. And I'm going to bump up the carrier frequency up to 20 gigahertz. And now let's take a look at our signal. So here we have our wideband FBMC signal. It's centered at 20 gigahertz, spanning over 2 gigahertz of bandwidth. And so with that, I'd like to thank you for your time today. Thank you.